What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. It's your boy Terror Bite reacts back with another reaction. God of High School. Very cool series so far. Five episodes in. We're about to embark on the sixth episode of God of High School, man. Last episode, got to see Han versus Jin. You know what I'm saying? Like that was a really good episode um kind of showed you know a little bit of more of the vulnerable side of this anime if you will you know what i'm saying show that they can bring out certain emotions but that's a usual thing in anime like that is not so far-fetched it's not hard to write you know what i'm saying into animes because they always do a good job with music to always set the scene now that is not to say that this story you know what i'm saying five episodes in there's no story <laughs> yet still don't know where this is heading other than you know we know that there's a tournament and we're kind of trying to do some character development with these three characters that we've come to know and love so far um so i'm hoping you know what i'm saying five episodes in you know what i mean like eight episodes to go right um i'm gonna be doing four of those episodes in this session that i'm sitting here you guys are still gonna get them one by one of course um but it's just so weird to me how animes can take so long sometimes to get into it like we all know what happened season one episode five in the attack on titan even though you still really don't know the true story of attack on titan but it was enough to get you in the gate by episode five you were wondering like what kind of anime am i watching the stakes are so high there's no stakes in this anime yet we don't know still trying to find out the mechanics the power system and all of this other stuff about this anime still don't really know much about it but it's very interesting it's keeping me intrigued but as i said before this is not quite so much about the story that you know the average person who's not doing reactions would stay on you know what i'm saying um a lot of people just watch things because they're popular don't get me wrong there's a lot of people that do that they just watch stuff because it's popular oh everybody's reacting to this i should watch this show you know what i'm saying um and also of course the people who have been reading the webtoon of course they want to they want to see this series animated you know what i'm saying they know what's about to come they have a more and i'm pretty sure when it comes on to you know what i'm saying the parts of this anime that explain a lot i'm pretty sure the manga does a very good job or a better job you get what i'm saying it's usual it's usually what happens you know what i'm saying when it comes on to um anime and why do i feel like my camera is not symmetrical look at my arms bro <laughs> like i'm looking at my camera and i'm like does my camera seem like it's like slight slightly le lean to one side look at my shoulders bro like my shoulders are you know what i'm saying like it's weird <laughs> okay i'll fig i'll try and fix it after because i think it's tilting just a little bit too much to my to my um left i think yeah that's my left side so don't pay attention to that camera okay that's my left <laughs> Okay. anyways it doesn't look too bad it's just that i notice it because i'm sitting now looking at myself but yeah let's get back to it <laughs> sorry for that brief intermission anyways thank you guys so much for tuning in as always man i'm looking forward to seeing what they have in store and why was this such a popular anime other than the fighting scenes the fighting scenes are pretty cool um and i'm guessing we're gonna get a lot more of that before this first season ends you know um so i'm looking forward to it anyways guys let's jump in and i will see you guys at the end for the review hope you guys have been hitting that like button man let's go The cult people? Oh, this is Jin Tejin, whatever his name is. <laughs> uh, 
Why though? <laughs> Something went down. Qualities of the key. Oh, it's three on three. Okay. The six. Okay, so that's what the title is about. Unbelievably Goku esque. Wait a second, didn't the guy, that was the guy that was sitting at the... I'm pretty sure it was this guy that just passed him with the thing over his eye. Oh! The hell? Oh, that's his master. Sage fruit. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he said I'll take. I thought he was. So he wants to train Jin. Knox. Who the hell is Knox? Yo!
Bro, what what am I watching right now? This is crazy. I know not whose child it is. It existed before God. He's blind? How the hell is this man officiating the matches blind? I just get in the feeling that Park is just not a bad dude. Like, I don't know what his motives are, but he just doesn't come off as a... I don't think he's a bad guy in the story. Oh, he wants to know about Chariuki. He acupunctured the shit out of him. <laughs> oh, they need to unlock their... Is Nox the name of the organization? Okay. 
You don't even know what just happened. Bro, okay. Let's pause because they just dropped a whole bunch of lore in like, I don't know, 30 seconds or so. And I really want to understand this karaoke power. I'm going to call it whatever I want to call it, okay? I'm never going to pronounce that right. I don't speak j Japanese. <laughs> Listen, karaoke, karaoke, okay? Whatever you want to call it. So from what I can understand, it's borrowed power from the gods. So it's basically something that you can have access to. Those, and, and it seems like everybody can tap into this power, it seems. Um, they just got to know how to do it. Uh, so it's borrowed power from the gods, whether it be um, Savage Beast or, you know, the Almighty himself. I'm guessing this is like legends or historical legendary gods from... Um, I don't know, maybe it's from whatever history they choose to draw from, whether it's the Greek history or Japanese history, or Korean history, or whatever it is, Indian industry, history, Chinese industry, in <laughs> Chinese history. I keep saying industry. But as far as I can, can from what I understand from what took place, is that you know, this is bar it's borrowed power. It's not necessarily their power. They borrow the power and make it their own. And he, they've gotten a warning that everybody at the next level of the tournament is three on three. They're all going to have these powers. So the next round or the next stage at nationals. I mean, what from what they just showed just now with the dude looked like he was going to swallow up the dude and the dude stopped him from swallowing up the, the guy. Um, the guy the guy that threw out the fire, he's the one that we saw at the, la at the end of the last episode, I think. All right, let's do it. I'm guessing that um Yo, the dude took him out. Or maybe, why are they going after the administrators? They just gonna body kill like that? You're kidding me, bro. They're just gonna body kill, bro. What is going on? Like, they just... Episode 5 down here? Episode 6 just... <laughs> Episode 6 just took, just took it from all the way down here to all the way up here. That's crazy, bro. Like, so much information in that episode. And I'm definitely hooked now. I want to see what happened next. Oh, man. That was crazy. All right. So, that was Episode 6, man. They dumped a lot of... 
I want to say not a not a ton, but a lot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like it was a lot of lore. You know what I've been asking for. They just took it up a whole notch of this episode and get me more intrigued into the story. I especially is very intrigued about this Knox organization. They're the cult. I've been calling them the cult this whole time, but they they are the cult, right? So I've been wondering like what what is their motive here? What what are they trying to do? You know what I'm saying? It seems like in in no in, in certain aspects of what of what's going on, they're trying to interrupt the tournament. But they are a part of the tournament because I saw some dudes with hoodies that qualify for the tournament. Or are they just trying to take out anybody that would, um, you know, you know, um, say they're planning to cheat? I don't know what the situation is, but they did. I think they have a bigger purpose because of what happened to um, Maury's grandfather. Right. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking. They went to attack him. He's unbelievable, by the way. They didn't show they didn't show it, but this man. It looked like he kicked. Um, he kicked away the mountain. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but he destroyed all them dudes that was in front of him. And then seems like somebody from Knox called a sword down from heaven. <laughs> I don't know what that's about, but. We're definitely going to learn more about it. But at the same time, what I look at in this series and what I love about this series so far, six episodes in, and is the fact that even though the lore building is a little bit slow at this point, and you know, I know some people is going to be like six episodes in is nothing. You get what I'm saying? But I've spoke about it plenty of times in, in, you know, for me, when it comes on to anime, I love when anime gets to the point early i like it but for reaction sake i will watch at least the first season of whatever that is suggested for me to watch because i want to give it the time of day and i've also learned my lesson from watching one punch man because five episodes into one punch man it was it wasn't boring the action scenes were done well it was funny some you know some of the stuff was funny there was some great action sequence that was crazy madhouse was just destroying the animation in that anime and it's just like you know what i'm saying the story just wasn't there the story for one punch man is still not there when you're talking about i'm talking about season one we didn't really get any understanding of what could be taking place or or leading into something you get what I'm saying? Until I think it was like episode 11 or 12 when we learned when, you know, I, I don't even remember. Some dude walked up to um to Genos and said something about, you know, tell him to watch out for somebody. And then we got a lot more development in season two. But my God, they took a long time to get to the point in One Punch Man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it was enjoyable nonetheless seeing the animation so great and of course madhouse what what more can you say they're just just really good animators so um for this anime i know it's starting out a bit slow but episode six just dropped a bunch of lore bombs on our heads in this episode just just blast everything open let us know what's going on with the tournament how the tournament is going to continue at nationals what's the difference of what's going to happen and all this other stuff you know what i'm saying so for me when i look at it and what i'm expecting this first match is going to put up our three against some other three um so i'm looking forward to seeing that so um it's it's crazy and as i said man i don't think that park is a bad guy i don't think the six as they call themselves i don't think they're bad people i think um i think they're they're doing this so they can strengthen them for for for, for a nox attack or something i think that's why he called in the six the six because i think they are i think one of the six wasn't one wasn't it a, a, a one of them one of those six that showed up for the dude, the slipper dude back and, and he was like scared and discovered his chariot or whatever the situation is. It's like, 
I, she, I think it was one of them, if I'm not mistaken, um, seeing the six again, I mean, seeing the six here in this episode, I think it was one of, one of them, uh, one of the girl ones that was talking to that slipper dude back in like, I think it was like episode three or something like that. I don't remember exactly which episode, but, um, not that that's coming back to me, but you guys can let me know in the comment section. I'm pretty sure I'm right, but I don't think the six are, are bad people. Um, because he turned up, he, he heals Jin's leg. You know what I'm saying? With acupuncture. It was very weird by the way, but Hey, it's pretty cool stuff. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, don't forget to hit the like button on your way out. If you have not done so already, hopefully you guys are enjoying these reactions, man. We're not going to stop. We're not going to bow. Hopefully YouTube fix my notifications and we can get back in, on track. Um, we'll see what happens. Anyways, guys, leave a comment in the comment section. And of course, you know what to do. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Terabyte Reacts and I'm out. Peace.